I've just never had a relationship with that kind of passion, you know, where, where you have to have somebody right there in the middle of a theme park. <laughs> well, it was the only thing to do there that didn't have a line. <laughs> Well, see, I mean, Barry wouldn't even kiss me on a miniature golf course. Come on. No. He said we were holding up the people behind us. And you didn't marry him because... I mean, do you think there are people that go through life never having that kind of... Probably. Really? But, but you know, I'll tell you something. Passion is way overrated. Yeah, right. It is. Uh, eventually, it kind of burns out. But... Hopefully what you're left with is trust and security and, uh, well, in the case of my ex-wife, lesbianism. <laughs> so, you know, for all those people who miss out on that uh, passion thing, there's all that other good stuff. <sighs> okay. But, uh, but I don't think that's going to be you. You don't? Mm. See, I see uh, big passion in your future. Really? Mm. You do? I do. Oh, Ross, you're so great. It's never gonna happen. What? You and Rachel. Why not? <laughs> because you waited too long to make your move, and now you're in the friend zone. No, no, no. I'm not in the zone. Oh, Ross, you're mayor of the zone. <laughs> Look, I'm taking my time, all right? I'm, I'm, I'm laying the groundwork. Yeah, I mean, every day I get just a little bit closer to, uh... Priesthood! <laughs> Ross, I'm telling you, she has no idea what you're thinking. And if you don't ask her out soon, you're going to end up stuck in the zone forever. I will, I will. I'm just... See, I'm waiting for the, uh, the right moment. What? <laughs> what, now? Yeah. <laughs> What's messing you up? The wine, the candles, the moonlight? Huh? You just got to go up to her and you got to say, look, Rachel, I think... <laughs> We're shushing because we're we're trying to to hear something. What? Mm. Uh, don't you hear that? Ah. See? Uh huh. <laughs>